object, plastic crap! You doing this to me? Who do you think you are, you piece of plastic shit? Ah! Ah! Screw you! It is my favorite Alburo movie. It died. What else can I do? It's probably not plugged in. What? Damn. No matter. I can buy a hundred more. Now, Tommy. Each month, a freelancer sails into Vice City and moors his yacht. He sells his cargo to the first boat. I want you to take the speedboat and beat all the other shitheads to it. Then you bring the cargo here. Okay? Let me guess. You thought I could use a guardian angel. I'm just saying, you need to let me in there, my man. Now you can feed me all this lonely tough guy crap. But I know one day, I'm gonna save your ass, and you're probably gonna wanna kiss me. Wacko. <laughs> we got some competition! Like Moonbeam or Wave or So Tommy, we know it was Diaz busted our deal. So why in the hell are we running errands for? The more we learn now, the less we have to learn when we take this town over. I like your town, man. Real friend. Yes, I think I can see that now. Moving on. Pastor Richards, in your book, you talk about putting yourself first and how people should not make sacrifices or help those in need. Do you want to elaborate? Oh, that's right. People need to learn how to take care of themselves and not depend on others. If you read chapter 45 of my book, I talk about how being selfish is a virtue. The best thing you can do for someone that needs help is to tell them to help themselves. That builds moral character. Morality, Maurice. There's not much left in this city. Every time a culture has taken on the... Watch yourself! They're coming from all over! Get the kids as fast as you can! To a neighbor. Eat it! Eat it! Someone's invading, burning down their homes, and taking their toilet. Sleep with the fish! All of them. After you read my book, you will understand. I may have been born to see. Are we gonna talk about being naked? Yeah, <laughs> soon, Barry. Keep your hair on and uh, uh, calm down, please, my friend. <clears throat> Divorce rates are up, standardized test scores are down, vampire sightings at the mall, can the family be safe? Or, to put it another way, if we're meant to be monogamous, why weren't we born already married? Jan, over to you. They're coming on that, Since Daddy! I'm a happily married mother, I know the family unit is the basis of all society. Even when my husband is working late right, or away on an extended business trip to her life. Just how important the family unit is in life. He's working hard so I can get another station wagon with even more wood on it. Go on. Tell me more about this. Uh, well, I like to compare it to nature. After all, it is. What some of this? Just want to name and kill each other, especially now. Now look at sharks and sandworms. Oh, and one of my hobbies, besides making babies and criticizing people, is biology. You learn so much from nature. Uh, people these days, they don't grow their own food. They can barely get out of their recliners and make it to the supermarket. <laughs> I tell you, there is nothing super about that place. Now, kids these days don't know how to preserve and can their own food. Now, no wonder all they want to do is play g video games or hang out with their friends. What is it, the Degeneratron? What a crock of shit. Good shooting, my friend. You're a real, proper, grade-A lunatic. Well, thank you. See you around, Tommy. Okay, Mr. Lance Vance Dance. 